we ask you today to look with us to Philip to uh, First Timothy chapter four, looking at verse number one through verse and number five. It's a great joy to have the opportunity to be again back in your homes. We are praying and hoping that something will be said that will spur you and drive you to obey the gospel of Christ if you never had. And if on the other hand you have and you've fallen away from the gospel of the Lord, we hope that you will come back on bending knees and with folded hands before the great God of heaven. Well, will you look with us today? But the Spirit said expressly that in the latter times some shall fall away from the faith and give it heed to seducing spirits and doctrines of demons through the hypocrisy of men that speak lies, branded in their conscience as with a hot iron, forbidden to marry and commanded to abstain from meat, which God created to be received with thanksgiving by them that believe and know the truth. For every creature of God is good, and nothing is to be rejected, if it is received with thanksgiving, for it is sanctified through the word of God in prayer. Well, briefly, I would like to think with you uh, from the subject, why do people fall away from the faith? Or why do people fall away from uh, the gospel? Uh, 